Just a quick note before this free video. If you click like and subscribe, I'd be very thankful. So they are doing this show. And they did a show-long storyline involving The Miz, of all people. So The Miz is backstage. Or first, first there's a segment from after the show ended last week. And Miz goes up to Karrion Cross and the crew, and he says, Listen, we got to go our separate ways. This is not working out. I don't want anything to do with these Wyatts. And Cross screams at him that one of my guys took a bullet for you. The only way out, Cross says, is either through the Wyatts or through us. So they, that was last week. So then they go live this week. And Miz goes up to Adam Pierce, who is having a bad day because he always is. And Miz starts screaming at him. You know, I main evented his whole stupid resume. And Pierce, who's having a bad day, starts laughing. Miz goes, what are you laughing about? Pierce points behind him. There's Karrion Cross in the crew. Karrion says, you're going to do something tonight, Miz. You are going to find... Bo Dallas. And when you find him, you're going to ask him why he's getting involved in my business. Either that, he says, or I'm going to break your legs. This is like, oh, man. So they, they continue. They go on to the uh, main event. First, we have a Jimmy. We'll talk about that later. But they go to the main event. They do the main event. Watch the main event. And, and... I guess we'll talk about the main event. The main event of this show, okay, the go-home Raw for Crown Jewel is Damian Priest versus Dirty Dom. There's a bunch of interference. Dom pins Damian, and then Damian destroys the Judgment Day, and the show ends. And I watched it, and I went, why was that the main event? With the exception of Liv who's facing someone on the other show. Not a single solitary person in the main event segment on Raw is even on the pay-per-view. I could not for the life of me. What this felt like, when this was over, this is what I determined. Everybody woke up, wrote a three-hour show, and about halfway through realized, oh my God, we're only two hours still. And so they went off the air an hour. They had an hour left of television they didn't show us. Because this right here was a top of the third hour match with another hour that should have come afterwards. So the show ends. And I'm like, what in the heck? Did we miss a full hour here? And then I realized as I was reviewing the show with Dave later, we never found out what happened. Like, did Miz find Bo Dallas? Was that supposed to be in the third hour that didn't air? Like, what happened here? So... I wake up this morning, I open up my Twitter, and on my timeline is a segment that they put on social media after Raw. I never see these. I never watch them. Actually, somebody had also emailed me. So, like, once people start emailing me that I got to watch something, it's like, okay, this must be something. So, I click on it, and it's a video of Karrion Cross in his hotel room, okay? And he's like, he's he's eating or something. He's just kind of sitting there, whatever. And you see Scarlet walk up in the background. And she goes, I, I, this, this, I, I, this is all, I don't remember. I didn't write it down or anything. But she walks up and she goes, Karrion, Miz has been kidnapped by the Wyatts. We need to go find him. And Cross, he's just calmly eating doing whatever and he goes he's been uh, he's been kidnapped scarlet goes yeah and cross goes like just now scarlet goes yeah he just he's gone and carrion's like eating or whatever he's totally calm and he goes how long has he been gone scarlet goes i don't know 20 25 minutes Cross is eating, and he goes, 25 minutes. He's dead for sure. Just keeps eating. Scarlet cracks. She's like, I mean, we should still look for him. Cross goes, dude, 
It's been 20 minutes. He's dead. There's no use. Guy's dead. <laughs> Starcy. I was crying watching this segment. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and click that notify button and you'll never miss a video again.